Good morning and Happy New Year. So Elaine and I are just getting ready to go out and we're under a little bit of time pressure because it is just 10 a.m. now and Elaine has an eye test booked for half 10. We have a busy enough day today ahead because I'm gonna try and get a haircut because it's been like I think maybe nearly two months since I got my haircut. It's getting ridiculous now. That's really starting to annoy me. So I'm gonna do that while Elaine's getting her eye test done and then we have some stuff to do in the afternoon with Frank and then I think we're gonna try and take down our Christmas decorations because if we don't do it today it's gonna be at least another week and if we leave another week that's a ridiculous amount of time to still have our decorations up after Christmas Just up in Liffey Valley and I'm gonna go and see if I can get my hair cut now and hopefully I won't have too long to wait. So I've got my hair cut and I'm actually really happy with how it looks because the last time I went to that barber's I wasn't thrilled with the haircut I got there but the one I got today way better, really nice. So I'm just gonna go and grab some Nespresso pods now because I've run out and then I'm gonna go and find a lane. So we've come into Gourmet Burger Kitchen just to get some lunch and it's our usual kind of go-to place when we're up in Liffey Valley. So we're just going to have something quick to eat now and then we need to go home and get the dog so we can take him out to this sighthound walk later on this afternoon. So we've just arrived up at the sighthound walk and we were running late but we made it on time. We're just home and we've got all our stuff to put our Christmas decorations away and I'll just show you. Frank really wants this Santa and we obviously don't want to give it to him. Because he destroyed one of my dad's house over Christmas? Yeah. Hey, go on. Yeah, go on. So he seems to be a lot giddier than he was when we put the tree up so I feel like it might be more challenging to take everything down than it was to actually put it up. But one thing when we were on our way out to the Sighthound meetup, um, we were driving out and basically we saw some poor guy who wasn't watching where he was going and he drove into the side of somebody else's car and like they, they all got out and they were blocking up the road for a few minutes and do you want to tell everyone what you said? In my defense, nobody was injured. Sorry, the dog is messing behind me. Nobody was injured. And they had been there when we'd left them for a couple of minutes to chat, but they were basically like talking about and exchanging numbers in the middle of the road. And no cars were damaged enough that they couldn't just pull in and let, there's loads of traffic building up. So I, knowing that we were late and we were in a rush, rolled down the window and went, yo dude in the, <laughs> yo dude in the Audi, can you just like pull up onto the path? The other guy was like, uh, we'll just be a minute. And I was like, yeah, but he can pull up. I feel, I actually feel kind of bad about it. In her defense, he did actually pull up and we were able to get through. But um, yeah, it was, it was very, very funny. I mean, it wasn't funny for him because, you know, he has to pay for two cars to be fixed. But... Oh yeah, because the guy I was asking to move was the guy who had driven his Yeah, Yeah, he was, he was completely at fault. Um, but it's... Nobody was hurt, so it's one of those things. We had a lovely time at the Sighthound meetup. It was our first Sighthound meetup of 2020. And yeah, it was really nice to see all the doggos and to walk around. And I thought Frank would be a bit more tired, but I think he's giddy because he thinks he's getting toys and stuff, and he's not. But once he realizes that we're just putting stuff away, he'll just probably go back to sleep.
So for dinner tonight, Elaine made fish with tomato sauce and black olives. And we had it with couscous and some roasted veg. It was really, really nice. And while we were having that, Frank was basically just doing this. Without he, being rubbed. Yes. He's really tired after the walk today. And he's just chilling on the couch. Being a big lazy lump. So we've all just been chilling on the couch for the last little while and Elena's gone up to bed now. And myself and Frank are still just here chilling and watching some TV. I'm just going to take it easy for the rest of the night with Frank now and probably leave this video here. But I just wanted to say Happy New Year and I hope everyone has a great 2020. I'm excited for everything that the new year has to offer and I can't wait to make more videos this year because 2019 was a pretty big year for me and this channel and I'm excited for what 2020 has to bring. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this one here. I hope you like it. If you do, please give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in the next video.